The meeting of representatives of sexual minorities in Uganda reportedly took place at a hotel in Entebbe this morning. The Minister for Ethics and Integrity, Father Simon Lokodo, was tipped about the meeting and immediately headed to the venue. Over 30 gay and lesbian members of this society, including expatriates, people who had come from abroad, had gathered at this hotel for the last 10 days when I think they have been organizing their activities, empowering each other and authenticating their presence in this country. As one who is applauding the Council of Uganda, I advised them to leave and disperse immediately. But the group's program coordinator, Pepe Onjima, told NTV on phone that the minister's action was illegal and a violation of the right to assemble. There's nothing to do with uh, homosexuality, as and it was, because he said that we were homosexuals gathering in a room and whatever we are doing, we should do it in our own rooms, not in a public space. And what he did was illegal, and we, we strongly condemn it. The issue of homosexuality in Uganda has attracted widespread international attention. <laughs> if the means starving without aids from Europe because of uh, so, so, imposing homosexuality on us, we will not die but remain culturally clean. It is a bad practice. It is quite an accuse because even animals which just work on instinct without intelligence, without reasoning, they can never mount same-sex. The prohibition of the meeting of sexual minorities comes on the heels of last week's retabling of the anti-homosexuality bill by Dora West MP David Bahati. The bill criminalizes the practice and promotion of homosexuality in Uganda. Chris Sochamringa, NTV.